Hey guys, it's Jess. Today I'm back with another video and today I will be talking about my skincare products and what I do to keep my skin clear. I actually have been struggling with acne for many, many years. I started having acne when I was in grade 7 and it was just kind of really, really bad until I was in grade 10. It kind of cleared up a bit and I was fine for a whole year but then in grade 11 and 12 it came back and it was really really bad again I had like cystic acne it was like all over my forehead and face like it was actually really bad until this day I still don't know what actually triggered the comeback of my acne but basically even through um, my first year of university I still had quite bad acne but this past summer that like, it cleared up majorly I have pretty much clear skin now I do get little blemishes every once in a while if I'm really really stressed out or if um, I'm at that time of the month kind of thing I do get little pimples but I don't get big patches all over my face or I don't get really really big volcanic um, pimples anymore these are the products that I use that pretty much cleared up my skin and I would like to share them with you guys. So this video is going to be split up into five categories with like cleansers and then I'm going to talk about like serums and then moisturizers and after that I'm doing like spot treatment and also at the end it's like masks that I use to help my skin clear up. Some background information about my skin, I have oily combination skin but my skin type kind of changed throughout the year and now it's more dry and normal instead of oily. So on cleansers, I have this product that I absolutely swear by. It's amazing. And this product is by Lush. It is Herbalism. It's just one of their cleansers. It looks like this. I know it's kind of gross, but you just mix these thingies with water and it turns into this paste. And it's really, really nice because it helps you exfoliate your skin while it cleanses it, but it's gentle enough. And this thing is actually, like the description is, a herbal combination of nettles and dro... Oh, <laughs> nettles and rosemary. For some reason there isn't like a little space there. To balance and cleanse the skin with almonds and rice bran to gently exfoliate. And it's 100% natural. I absolutely love Lush products and I think they're amazing. Um, this cleanser helped me clear up my skin so much. It, like even if I go two days without using this, I can feel how like my skin is more dry and there can be little bumps. But when I use this, it just exfoliates my skin and all these little dry patches or anything are gone. I usually use this only at night because when I wake up in the morning, I mean my skin's pretty just fine and it's moisturized. I don't really need the harsh like exfoliation. So in the mornings, I actually just use my body shop um, tea tree skin clearing facial wash and this thing says it's suitable for blemished skin intense daily cleansing removes impurities for clearer looking skin and it does have a really strong scent to it like if you don't like tea tree oil it's quite hard for you to use it because it does smell like a lot like tea tree oil like I don't really care about scents that much my first priority is just to clear up my skin because when I do have like blemished skin, I just don't feel confident. It actually does help a lot and it's very gentle. You feel like fresh afterwards because of the scent. It kind of wakes you up in the morning to be honest. But yeah, that's what I use in the morning and this is what I use at night. And then off to serums and stuff. I have one serum that I swear by and I always use it. I use it every night for sure and sometimes in the morning depending on my mood. If I'm feeling fancy, then I'll use it. I would say like three days in a week I use it in the morning as well as night. And this is the Origins Original Skin Renewal Serum with Willow Herb. And it is 30 milliliters. Um, this stuff actually smells amazing. I love the smell of it. One of the reasons I think that I'm struggling with acne is that I don't exfoliate my skin enough or that it's not renewing fast enough. My metabolism all over my whole body actually is quite slow so I like to use this to like speed it up and kind of renew my skin so it looks more clear like fresh um, without scars and it's just more supple and stuff and I absolutely love this serum it's amazing so you should all go grab it right now. Off to moisturizers as I said in my last video Cetaphil um, Daily Advanced Ultra Hydrating Lotion 
for dry to very dry skin. Um, it's non-greasy, it's fragrance-free, and it's clinically proven to hydrate and protect dry skin for 24 hours. And this stuff is so great. Like, you don't need a lot of it. You just need a little bit, and it's like, your skin just feels amazing. Like, it's like you drink up all the moisture, and it kind of absorbs into your skin really quickly. And like I said, you don't feel it. It just absorbs into your skin. It's not greasy. It's not sticky or anything, because I hate that. One of the reasons of struggling with acne as well is that your skin isn't moisturized enough. So your skin just naturally, your body produces oil to moisturize your skin and the oil just clogs your pores and make you suffer like with pimples. But if you moisturize your skin enough, it genuinely makes a huge difference in acne. When you struggle with acne, you want to stick to like a simpler regimen. You don't want to use too many products because otherwise it's just going to irritate your skin and it's not going to be good for you because I used to do that. I used to try out all these different products and I don't even stick to it. I probably like buy a new product and I just use it for maybe like two weeks or a month and then I'm like, oh, it doesn't work. I need to try out another thing and I just keep switching up products using a lot of different products and that's just not good for your skin. Also, you want to have just like all your daily skincare products. You want them to be simple and without like too many chemicals or like fragrance free and oil free as well because these chemicals do irritate your skin. This moisturizer I use it day and night but sometimes at night if I'm feeling fancy I will use um, just vitamin C or vitamin E cream. Here I have one by Scar Care. It's just a vitamin C and E cream. It's 100% natural with vitamin C, vitamin E, rosehip oil, aloe and evening primrose oil. I just bought this, I think in Thailand, I'm not quite sure, I don't remember. But I was on vacation and I just saw this and it's just completely natural. And vitamin C and E are really good for your skin. I just use this a lot at night. If I'm not feeling my Cetaphil moisturizer, I use this or sometimes I even double it. I put this on top because it's a lot thicker and it moisturizes your skin really well but it's a little bit too much for daytime use. Yeah. So the next category is spot treatment. Like some people say spot treatment don't work but I think it works, okay? <laughs> like when I have a pimple coming up I can feel it or when it's out I put this on. Again it's by Lush, it's amazing, it's the Grease Lightning spot treatment. A lot of people rave about this, it's absolutely amazing. So there is tea tree oil and witch hazel in this. These two ingredients are honestly the enemy of pimples. I put this on before I go to sleep and when I wake up in the morning usually it's either gone or it's completely dried up and I can just... Okay, let's be honest, I pop my pimples but you know, like you pop it and you put this on like it's just gone. Like it speeds up the process so quickly and it's just kind of transparent because I don't like going to sleep with like white dots all over my face even though I'm going to sleep but I just don't like that <laughs> and it's just really really good like if you have pimples on your face you have to try this because it's amazing and I've been using this for honestly years okay that is all for spot treatment and then off to mask and stuff I do it like once a week Sometimes I'm lazy and I don't, but usually I do it once a week. And I have three products that I want to recommend. The first one is my Origins. It is the Clear Improvement Active Charcoal Mask to Clear Pores. And it looks like this. And that is what charcoal does. For years, people have been saying, like, there's charcoal masks, charcoal face washes, charcoal toothpaste. Charcoal takes out and absorbs toxins. And this is really good. It's quite drying. I would say but usually what I do is I put on this mask and I leave it on for like 10-15 minutes and I wash it off and then I put on like a sheet mask that's moisturizing so it kind of just gives your skin like a little boost of moisture without drying it out but cleans it as well because this honestly just cleans your skin so well and you can tell the difference after using it it's amazing next is coconut oil this product is amazing. It's amazing for your skin, for your hair, for your face, for your body. It's like everything. But when you get coconut oil, make sure it is organic, extra virgin, and cold pressed. 
yeah what I do with this I use it all over my body to be honest uh, and when it's in room temperature it is a solid but once you take it out and warm it into your hands it melts and then it's just honestly this thing smells so good as well it's just like so great I love this product I discovered it um, last year and it's been amazing and so good to my skin I like to put it on my skin overnight so it's like overnight mask and it just smells really really good sometimes I put it in my hair too and just wash it out the next morning your skin will wake up looking so fresh and you'll look so much more awake like your skin will look less dull and moisturized and you can honestly feel the difference just by sleeping in it for one night this product is great and you should try it if you have it and I'm trying to just put this in the front okay you should try it if you haven't because it's really really good and the next mask I'll be talking about is by the body shop and it is a drops of youth bouncy sleeping mask it's smoothing refreshing and replenishing night cream gel again with the renewing thing I like to renew my skin a lot I actually I have been wanting to try retin a for a really really long time but it's a type of cream you have to get a prescription from like you have to go to a doctor and do that so I'm really not bothered to but yeah like the concept of retin-a is that it renews your skin and it just keeps regenerating so you have like nice skin on top so that is what I do with both the serum and this mask it is like that it's quite thick but you just scoop it out and you place it on your face and it's an overnight sleeping mask the texture is quite sticky though, that's the only thing I don't like about it because it is really sticky and it kind of like sticks your face to your pillowcase so that's quite annoying. But other than that, it's really really good. You can feel it the next morning as well. It's just like your skin is so fresh, so moisturized and you can tell that the stuff is working. Like honestly, all these products that I'm recommending right now, it makes a huge difference and you can actually tell just by one use it's like honestly they're so great and I totally swear by all these products they're amazing they're like my life staples <laughs> so yeah I hope you guys enjoy this video and maybe try out some of these products if you're struggling with acne or just trying to make your skin clear or I'm trying to make it stay clear but yeah um, this is my skincare routine and I hope you like the video